Welcome back guys, Chachi, Derek, George, and my cameraman, Tony. Did a good job, Tony. So George uh, took a shot at this bull, he hit it, and uh, wasn't too sure about the shot, and unfortunately we couldn't get the shot on video because Tony's camera gear failed, so there was no footage of the shot, so we were just going with the blood that we were seeing. Went about 150, 200 yards in a zigzag, and uh, Derek seen him, he says, I just seen him. Uh, stand up and walk away. So I told everybody to stay back. Uh, me and George started walking slowly in that moss as uh, it was kind of a low noise and sure enough we uh, got a glimpse of him. There was a fallen tree and it was one limb that was blocking us from taking a shot. So um, the bull started walking slowly but he could tell he was not feeling too good. At the end of the day uh, when in doubt back out. So it's what we did. We backed out and uh, left him overnight and this is how we found him in the morning. So once the pictures were all taken, made a decision to cut the animal up right here, take the hide off, put the cheesecloth on it, get it cooled off as, as much as we can. That way there you minimize any weight, any meat loss and uh, got those things skinned off pretty quick, packed it on a bike and, uh, and cools off the meat a lot faster. All right, George. This man strikes again. <laughs> Good times, people. What it's all about. That's good. That's good. Give it. Give it to her.